<laughs> Let me get this camera set up. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. <laughs> this poor guy here can't get in and get any food. They won't let him in. One head in each little compartment. <laughs> this poor guy's been whining. I've been over here rubbing his belly and he was just loving that. But they are just getting so big. As you can see, uh, we let it run out of food for one day. And luckily they didn't tear it up at all. They just moved it around a little bit. This thing is on here locked solid. So uh, we're trying to make sure it don't run out of food, but God, they eat it so fast. They eat 150 pounds in about four days. About four days. This guy right here has just been loving getting his belly rubbed. Yeah. He's just been loving that. You liking that, buddy? Huh? You liking that, buddy? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I like getting up here scratching on him. I think they like it too. But stick around today, guys. We're going to go uh, process some ducks. We got some peaking ducks. Uh, that we really hadn't been videoing that much. I don't know if we've even done a video whatsoever on them. Uh, but we've had them eight weeks. They just blew up. And we've been raising them for meat. And uh, they're just awesome little ducks. Super fat. Look at this guy. You want to come over here and play? Get in there and make a move. Get in there and make a move. He's been whining trying to get in there. And the other two stuck their heads in and they have not cut him a break whatsoever. Not whatsoever. But he'll find room to get in there here in a second. But yeah, we're going to go do these ducks. Uh, I'm not sure how many we got to process. I think seven. But they're just huge ducks. They swelled up really fast. Eight weeks, they're ready to go. Travis is down there now getting started, so I'm going to go help him. And stick around. We're going to go check out our new little puppy uh, that we just got yesterday. Today's Sunday. Uh, we're going to do a live tonight, which this will be out on Monday. <laughs> For you guys that didn't catch us, uh, on Sunday night, we go live every Sunday night at 9 o'clock. For you guys that didn't catch us, uh, I thought I'd do a video introducing our new little puppy. So stick around for that. I think you're going to love her. She's just adorable. Uh, she's just loving playing with the kids. She's really taken to her house really well. The first night, she didn't whine whatsoever. Uh, my wife says she slept through the whole night. So far, just a dream dog. So uh, stick around. We're going to go process some ducks and check out some new little baby puppy. Well, guys, here's our Peking ducks that we have been raising up for meat. Let me show you these guys. They're getting here. They're nuts. But these jokers, and we don't feed them the day before, so if you guys are wondering, or the, or the night before, just so they'll be halfway cleaned out. I don't know if the camera does them justice. They are just absolutely giants. I would have to say maybe seven or eight pounds. They are actually bigger than, <laughs> I want to say they're bigger than the meat chickens that we raise. They are just super, super fat little ducks. And uh, we've never raised ducks before for meat. For you guys that are wondering, we've never raised ducks for meat before. And it was just a breeze. We let them out every day out here in the field, uh, out here in the, our little duck place. <laughs> I don't know what you call it. But uh, we let them out here with the other ducks. And they run around, they go in the swimming pool, they do everything the other ducks do, except for the day we process, so we don't have to chase them down. But they grew so fast. And we've heard they are absolutely delicious. Now, we have heard they're super hard to process. That's why we did such a small amount. Uh, we just wanted to give it a shot this year and see how it works out and see if we're going to try this every year. I have a feeling we'll probably do, uh, be doing meat ducks every year. They're just super easy, way easier than the turkeys. Our turkeys, we have never been able to raise turkeys. Uh, this is our third or fourth year, and uh, we get 10 or 15 every year and end up with one or two at the end of the year. And it's just, we don't do anything different. Uh, we've tried different things every year with the turkeys, but it's just, for some reason, we can't raise turkeys. But these Peking ducks have been a piece of cake for anybody that's curious about raising their own meat ducks. They have really been super easy. It's easy as any chicken we've ever raised. So stick around. We're going to process these guys real quick. Uh, probably won't do a lot of processing uh, video on this, but I just wanted to show you guys the ducks for the simple fact we didn't hardly do any video on them this year. We just sort of let them, let them grow and really hadn't fooled with them all that much. But today's processing day. We're going to run through these guys real quick and we're going to go check out our little puppy. All right, yeah. Come on well, guys, we got the ducks processed. Uh-oh. We got the ducks processed. I guess you want down, huh? 
You want down? I'm gonna let you down. Guys, this is our new little puppy. Uh, oh, she sees, look. She sees the chickens. Let's let her down. This is our new little puppy. Here, Kim. You got her. This is our new puppy, Mia. For you guys that didn't check us out live last night, we got her in Saturday. She's a long-haired uh, German Shepherd, and she is registered, and she's loving the farm. <laughs> and she's just adorable. She's still getting used to it. She hadn't started whining. She hasn't whined or anything. There she goes. She's been, what? Yeah, she's a little mopey. Uh, but she's been doing pretty good. She'll use the bathroom when we bring her outside. Uh, she has had some little problems on the in, on the inside, but that's normal. Hey. 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 <laughs> hey. Oh. We should have brought her ball out. But this is our new little farm puppy, Mia. And for you guys that all voted on the names, we really, really appreciate it. We had some great names uh, come in that we didn't even think of. But I think the three were Georgia, Mia, Ellie. and Ellie. Those were the top three. And with our votes, I think, she just yeah, yeah, our votes in the house brought it up to a, just over about 20. Yeah, it was a lot. Two, 23 votes to 18 yeah. between those two. Yeah. yeah. But look. <laughs> what is it? What is it? I think she's going to be a lot of fun. She's going to love living out here. And I think she's going to make a great farm dog. Right? Right? She's just the best. I haven't hardly got to see her. I've been working so much and all that. I think today's, ow, today's like the first time I've actually got to play with her much. Ow. Yeah, she's biting me. You want to play with her? Kind of hurt. Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> she got some sharp teeth, don't she? I know it. <laughs> All right, well, guys, this is Mia, our new little farm dog. She's just awesome. <laughs> she is just awesome. We're super excited to have her here. I hope you guys enjoy her too. Be ready. She's going to be on a lot of videos, I'm sure, as she grows up. Uh, Kim's going to be doing a lot of training. What all are you planning on doing with her? Well, I'm getting basic and more advanced training, but also want to have her as a therapy dog for later on when um, nursing homes, all the nursing homes can be back open to service dogs coming in and, or therapy dogs and bring her in and let her visit those mm -hmm. that live there. It's going to be a lot of fun. We can hardly wait. Don't pay the flowers no attention, guys. It's under construction. <laughs> but we are super excited. I hope you guys uh, are excited as we are. We appreciate all your help, too, giving her a name. We just love Mia. I think that's just uh, natural for us. We just loved it. We just loved Mia. It was really awesome. Look at her. I can't stop looking at her. But, guys, do us a favor. If you're not a subscriber, click that subscribe button. Hit the like button if you like this video. Share it. Thumbs up. Uh, all that stuff. Like, share, all that. Appreciate you guys so much for subscribing to our channel. Thanks uh, for all the help naming Mia. We really, really appreciate it. 
and we will see you guys on the next video.